Hi, everyone. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Mark Bradshaw. And I'm Brenna Rose. Some tense moments on an Okmulgee school bus were caught on camera today as a bus driver tried to break up a fight. The bus ended up hitting a street sign at a slow rate of speed. But as News Channel's Burt Muller reports tonight, at least one parent was concerned with how the incident was handled. Burt. Mark, a parent says that even several hours after the incident, she still hadn't received any kind of notification from officials that the event had even happened. The commotion on the bus was so loud that it caught the attention of Etta Shakota and her cats, who were sitting on their porch at 10th and Central. And I just heard that bus coming by and those kids was just loud. Okmogi police said they responded to a report of a bus colliding with a sign at 10th and Central. Now see that boy right there? Yeah. He was on the bus. These two girls always beefing. 14-year-old Trenton Dombo lives across the street from Miss Shakota and says the collision happened as a result of a fight. This one girl just walked up to her, started punching on her. So the bus driver jumped up, forgot to hit the brakes, I guess. Oh, no. And then pulled her off and they hit a sign. Police say it was a low-speed collision with no reports of injuries. But those kids got off the bus and just took off running. My kids, you know, walked home from the accident site. Parent Danielle Smith lives just down the street and wasn't exactly pleased with how authorities handled the aftermath. I mean, I'm flabbergasted. I still haven't received a call or email from the school police police say the bus wasn't badly damaged and was driven away as for that fight and the girl that was getting beat up jumped off the bus and ran away trenton says altercations on the bus are not uncommon burt mumlow news channel 8.